Hey everybody, it's Charlotte. Today on Maker's Moments, we will be teaching you how to find out how much candle wax you need. Calculating the amount of wax that you will need depends on how many candles you're planning to make, as well as the total ounce fill for each container. First, you will want to find out the total ounce fill for the vessel or container you plan to use. Many candle container companies will give you the ounce fill. For example, you can find the ounce fill for all the vessels from the Wooden Wood Co. under the description on each product page. Next, you will want to subtract an ounce from that container fill to account for your candle's fill line. For safety purposes, you never want to fill a candle container to its full capacity. Always allow for a minimum of approximately a quarter inch around the diameter of your candle to be free of wax. To do this, you can subtract one ounce of wax from your container fill. For example, if my container fill is eight ounces, I'd only be using seven ounces of wax to fill the container. Next, you'll want to add up the total amount of your ounce fill by the amount of candles that you would like to make. Here, I'm making six candles, so I would want to multiply seven ounces by six candles. I'll need a total of 42 ounces of wax. Most waxes out there will be sold in pounds. You will want to calculate the ounce conversion for your chosen wax. For example, virgin coconut soy from the Wooden Wick Co is sold in five pound slabs. This is equal to roughly 80 ounces of liquid wax, so I would need only one slab of wax and have some left over for this specific candle project. Ready to put your newfound knowledge into practice? How do you calculate the amount of wax you will need? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay in the know on all the latest makers tips and tricks. See you next time on Makers Moments. Happy making!